So today we're going to talk about one of the most characteristic chord progressions of the Pat Metheny group, the one going to the sixth of the minor. So I have it D here with its six degree BM and then DM with its six degree B flat. What we have in phase dance actually is that we start from D, then going to BM, but then moving to the six degree of the minor to B flat. And then we have this game of B minor to B flat, B minor to B flat. So after the initial tonic, we start this game of six degree of major to the six degree of D minor, B flat major. And this is a question for the channel, for you guys. You tell me in the comments, when is the next time that this D major comes back? Maybe it's not even in this track. You may have to listen to um, the whole album to come up with the answer. So in my first video on the way up part two, I talked about how we have this movement from one A flat to its minor six E. Then we have an ascending motion of D flat, DM and E flat minor. Each one of them is going to its six degree. So I have the same progressions that I had before for phase dance. Over here, a half step lower. We go from the sixth degree of the major, B flat minor seven, to the sixth degree of the minor, A. Same as we did here in phase dance, from BM to B flat, except right now we're gonna go from B flat minor seven to the fourth degree of A, which is D we're gonna play it over F sharp. Instead of the older. So to express the same kind of emotion, the old Pat Metheny group might have used this progression, like in phase dance. play this minor in a pretty sophisticated way. We have an arpeggiation in the bass, just like that. actually playing, if we have to simplify it, is a D, that goes to B flat. And then this B flat over D becomes 
D7, which is extended this way. By these arpeggios that leads us half step up to E flat minor that again goes to its sixth degree. Let me play for you right now real quick part two up until this point so we can see these local tonics going to their sixth degree. 